Hey, it's me again. Uh, I did say it was going to be my last video, but I forgot to read Psalm 23, so I'm going to do that separately in this video right here, okay? So this is going to be a very short video. Okay, here we are. Psalm 23. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. He makes me lie down in green pastures, he leads me beside quiet waters, he restores my soul. He guides me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake. For even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Now, this is a psalm that I like to read when I'm feeling worked up or upset or angry about something. I also find that drinking herbal tea, perhaps chamomile tea, uh, helps me a lot as well because that has a natural soothing property so if you ever find yourself worked up or sad or angry or upset or somebody said something that you've heard and you don't like it and you're angry within your mind and heart about something read this psalm psalm 23 you don't have to drink herbal tea at the same time like i do <laughs> it might be a good idea but if you can find a nice tree somewhere just get away from this world and all the madness and all the hypocrisy of this world. Um, and uh, yeah, and let me read that one more time, actually, because I like this psalm so much. Okay, It's so soothing and, and it just encompasses everything. Okay, Psalm 23, a psalm of David, how David loved God. He really, really did. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He restores my soul. He guides me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake. For even, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. And your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye, and take care.